U.S. President-elect Donald Trump has selected Robert F. Kennedy Jr. for Health Secretary. He will lead the Department of Health and Human Services, which is the United States' top health agency. Kennedy ran for president in this year's election, remember, as an independent before dropping out in August and then endorsing Donald Trump in exchange for a role in the Republicans' administration. Robert F. Kennedy Jr., he came in. And he's going to help make America healthy again. And now he's a great guy, and he really means it. He wants to do some things, and we're going to let him go to it. I just said, but, Bobby, Leave the oil to me. The Department of Health and Human Services oversees the Food and Drug Administration, the Center for Disease Control and Prevention, the National Institutes of Health, and the massive Medicare and Medicaid services program, which provide health coverage for the poor, those aged 65 and older, and the disabled. In his social media posts and interviews in the recent weeks, Kennedy Jr. indicated that his priorities include addressing what he calls the chronic disease epidemic of conditions, including obesity, diabetes, and autism, and reducing chemicals in our foods. Kennedy also suggested that he would gut the 18,000 employee Food and Drug Administration and replace hundreds of employees at the National Institutes of Health. Kennedy Jr. has been criticized for making false medical claims, including that vaccines are linked to autism. He opposed state and federal restrictions imposed during the COVID-19 pandemic and was accused of spreading misinformation about the virus. Kennedy disputes the anti-vaccine tag, saying that he wants more rigorous testing of vaccines instead. In an interview in March, when he was still running for the presidency, Kennedy said that Americans who want a vaccine for themselves or their children would continue to have access to them if he were to be elected. But he said that he doubted the efficacy of the measles vaccines. I'm going to require, first of all, anybody who wants to take a vaccine, I'm not going to get in their way. If you want a vaccine, if you want to vaccinate your children, those vaccines will be available. But I am going to tell the truth to Americans. I'm going to, I'm going to do for the first time good science, right? When I was a kid, there were three vaccines, and I took all three. There were three that were mandatory, that were recommended, which essentially means mandatory. And I was compliant. 